very slippery. So you gotta take it step by step. Oh, there we go. What's going on YouTube? I'm back with another video. So today we are getting ready to go to Mount Fuji. Yes, you heard me. Today is that Mount Fuji vlog that I told you guys about in my other video. So thank you guys for tuning back in. Thank you guys for coming back to my channel, for subscribing and coming along in my journey. So here we are getting ready. I got my suitcase down there. I got all the stuff ready, clothes folded out. Just packing right now and getting ready for our 11 hour drive. Yes. It's 11 hours away, so didn't really get much sleep last night just so I can be able to fall asleep on the ride there. Also, don't mind my hair. I'm about to go get a haircut right now. Yeah, it's a little long. I'll show you guys the aftermath. But um, yeah, thank you guys for coming on by. It's going to be a good vlog, so stick around and I'll see you in a bit what's going on you guys so as you can see I finally got my hair cut looks a whole lot better now getting ready times coming up close to go to Mount Fuji um, I got my stuff ready as you can see here this is my pack I'm gonna be hiking with and my other thing that I will need for the trip So it's all said and done, we're ready. I'm gonna wait for the bus to come pick us up. After that, we're on our way to Mount Fuji. What's going on, family? We're back. After 14 grueling hours, we finally made it to Mount Fuji to begin the hike. It was a long ride, but we finally made it. We're here, the weather's nice, the sun is out. Um, looks nice, I'm gonna show you guys the view of Mount Fuji right now, one second. That's where we will be climbing up to. So that's our destination. They're saying it's gonna take about five hours to reach the peak. Um, there's going to be a fast group, a intermediate group, and a slow group. And you know me, hey, we're gonna go with that fast group, see if we could get there in four to five hours get some really nice footage for you guys and yeah it's gonna be a good experience um, I've never hiked Mount Fuji you could tire yourself out very easily if you don't pace yourself so we'll see how it goes I got my pack on me ready got my boots ready gonna get up there and once we start climbing I will bring you guys along with me alright All right, you guys. So as you can tell, I took off one of the layers, took off the sweater I was wearing. Started getting really humid. I was getting fatigued very easily in the first 20 minutes. So I decided to take off one layer since I am wearing 50 pounds on my back already. So decided to take off a layer. It's making this hike a whole lot better. Um, but as we get higher in elevation. It is getting a whole little bit more cooler. So I may end up throwing on that sweater again. Quick update where we're at, you really can't see. It's getting super cloudy now. They're, they're saying it might rain. So we're trying to get to the top so we could avoid the rain. I got my stick here, it's helping me out throughout most of the hike. You get some cool little stamps here. So each stamp represents the stage. Whoa! Each stamp represents each stage that you are accomplishing here towards the hike to Mount Fuji. It gets a little pricey, just a heads up. Each stamp is around three to five hundred yen which is equivalent to three to five dollars so i got about ten ten stamps so far so that tells you how much i've spent but everything's going well i'm alive and we'll see you soon
いい塩梅になったっすねさすが見極めが<笑>この片方だけ上げた後は何だろうAll right, you guys. So we reached 1,000, no, 11,000 feet at this point. You could really tell that the oxygen level is dropping. And uh, it's uh, getting a whole lot harder to breathe. But it's not bad. It really is not that bad so far. <laughs> but keep it on stepping. At this point, I already drank two liters of water. <laughs> Probably should have conserved a little more. But I was really thirsty. Probably grab a bottled water that they sell up here in one of these stands. But yeah, we're gonna keep it stepping. We alive, we good. We're almost to the top and we ain't gonna stop. So I will see you up there in the next clip. All right, you guys. So we finally landed in the summit. We're about a hundred feet out. It's been three hours since we started hiking. Not bad for the tallest mountain in Japan to be able to hike it in three hours. So here we are, the final destination. <laughs> Whoa, we're about 100 feet out. So all in all, the hike was good. Um, definitely recommend coming up here. Great view from here. Check it out.
These right here will make you choke. I don't recommend eating the crackers on the MRE. Everything else is good. But if you got something to wash it down with, it'll go down a whole lot smoother. But other than that, the crackers will definitely make you choke. After I finish this, I'm going to hike back down the mountain. I'll eat the main meal down there. All right, you guys. So welcome back. Now we're on our way down the mountain. As you can see, it's very slippery. So we gotta take it step by step. We're definitely gonna get down to the bottom a whole lot quicker than we got up here. Moving a whole lot quicker. Yeah, it's good. It didn't rain on us. It's not too hot. It's just perfect. And I had a couple buddies I got here, like last week, and it was raining down on them. So, it's not bad. But, I'm going to try to make it down the mountain, and I'll see you guys. So unfortunately, I was unable to record much once we descended down the mountain. Um, it was super hot. I got a really bad tan. Um, yeah, it was bad. Probably the worst part was going down the mountain, to be honest. My feet were killing me at that point. Um, blisters. I'm not trying to complain or anything, but yeah, it was pretty bad. It was a good hike overall. Um, apparently, from what I found out, was that not a lot of people climb the mountain there on the same day. They actually sleep in little huts there throughout the night. And it's a two-day uh, period which they do uh, climb the mountain. So myself and the other group are... Are crazy people for doing it in <laughs> less than four hours but it was a good experience I'm gonna get some rest now I hope you guys enjoyed that Mount Fuji vlog as much as I enjoyed recording it all right if you guys got any questions or comments please comment down below other than that I'm gonna shower get some rest and yeah just remember guys don't give up don't give in and keep grinding